Tip number 64. Backup and possibly do versioning of your project folders. This is a very important tip. Yeah, many people, they, they do not backup their computers. And, uh, you know, imagine that tomorrow morning you try to switch on your computer and it uh, doesn't start. Yeah, really, think with me. What everything you would lose if your computer doesn't start? All the projects. All the schematics and PCBs which you created for, I don't know, last five years, all of them would be gone. All the documents which you created would be gone. Not saying about the family photos and this kind of stuff, yeah? It's scary, just think, you know, all the work what you created, it's gone. And uh, it can really happen. I know many people uh, with crashed hard drives and many of them, they lost everything. Even right now, I uh, you may not believe, but right now on my table, I have a laptop because a friend of mine, she asked me to have a look on the laptop and there is, you can guess, corrupted hard drive. So it's really happening. It can happen anyone. It can happen to you and it can happen anytime. So to prevent this uh, situation, I was speaking in different tip about how we organize our folders uh, and uh, we regularly back up all the folders with all the important projects and all the important documents. Basically what we do is we have a server and uh, on the server we have uh, some directories which are mapped as a network drive and uh, from our local computer we access to these uh, files which are on the server and we work with them because speed is uh, quite important for us and in the background on the server there is a application running in our case we use a google drive so there is this google drive application running and in the backup it uh, or in the background it backup all the files to cloud it backup the files from the server and load them or update them on the cloud about the versioning, uh, I need to be honest, uh, I I tried the versioning, but uh, we really don't use it. I never like uh, needed to do versioning on my schematics or on my documents. We do versioning on our software, it is very useful on software. But, uh, you know, when I draw the schematic, usually I try to improve it. So usually there is no really need to go back to previous versions of the schematic. Uh, there are some situations when we uh, do big changes in the schematic, then uh, we need to back up the schematic, but we just, uh, you know, we just pack the folder where the schematic is located. We mark it with the date when it was packed and that's it. That's everything what we need. Just in case if the big changes go wrong, we can go back to the previous version. But normally in everyday life, I don't really, never, never needed uh, use the versioning in the schematic. Uh, I know some people, they use it, they like it. Uh, for example, they work uh, in the office and uh, then when they need to go and continue working on the project from home, they use the versioning. But again, this can be done maybe through some server stuff and these things. Uh, it's really up to you. We don't use the versioning, but we do use backup because it's very important. Tip number 64, backup and possibly do versioning of your project folders. Why? Anyone can lose the data on hard drive and it can happen anytime. 